Hi everybody, I'm Philip Duncan. Thanks very much for joining us. Well, our small but potent subtropical low is moving into the North Island and it walloped Gisborne and East Cape overnight, which we did expect uh, to see the worst of the winds and the heaviest of the rain. That happened and now the centre of that system is crossing over the northeastern corner of the North Island. The air pressure map today uh, included with the winds because the darker shading shows the low pressure to our north that I've been talking about a bit lately and the high pressure down here to the south. That is the squash zone in the middle between the centre of that low and that big high to the south and that's where the strong southeasterly winds are going to be across the next day or so but the middle of the low still got strong winds as well and along with some heavy rain. So this is the rain for the rest of Tuesday until Tuesday night till 7pm Tuesday. Heaviest downpours in pink and blue on the edge here. Not that blue but the blue amongst the pink shading along that eastern side. So those areas there around the pink could be getting another 50, 60 millimetres of rain today. And then here is the overnight map for tonight. This takes us through till 7 a.m. Wednesday. And once again, the heaviest downpours around Kaikoura, where you're talking 50, 60, maybe 70 millimetres more rain overnight tonight. Dry for the west coast, dry for Southland. So it's really an eastern system. This is how Wednesday shapes up. So the low weakening quite a bit now as it crosses over land. So around about a thousand hectopascals. The worst of the winds are further south now between the centre of the low and the centre of that high in the Southern Ocean. So squash zone pushes through Canterbury and the Southern Alps. Patchy rain. If you're going to field days, a couple of showers around, but it is improving across the day. So it's a pretty bright forecast and it stays even brighter or gets even brighter as we head in towards Thursday. Still maybe a couple of little light showers around, nothing scary. High pressure starting to build around the South Island and that low weakening further and moving away. Let's have a look at Friday, the end of the week, and high pressure just to the north of New Zealand, going back to the weather pattern that we had a couple of weeks ago, where the highs were to our north and the lows were to our south. Speaking of which, there's another one. But for Friday, a fairly nice day across New Zealand, mild with westerly winds, and they'll be fairly light. Saturday's also fairly mild. You'll see a light northwest breeze developing, but look what's waiting in the wings, the next low and the next cold snap. And once we get to Sunday, it's still a mild northwest day for most places. You've got some showers in the mix turning to rain further south, and this low marks the next southerly, which arrives once again for the start of the working week. That seems to be the pattern at the moment. Uh, by the way, the long-term trend is showing more of the same chaotic weather pattern, more lows with southern uh, or southerly breezes, and in the tropics, we're seeing more subtropical lows. So a bit of a crazy busy time of the year. That is all from me. We'll update you again on Wednesday. <laughs>